Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to uh, Dreamfall Chapters. Let's go ahead and uh, get Bip's help. Nope. My table's always open. All right. Are you ready? Can we go now? Yes, we are. There's Let's no go now. There's no reason to delay this mission. Let's go. Finally. Follow me. Look, I had to explore the town. The boy reminds me a lot of myself at that age. Orphaned, a street urchin living hand to mouth. We need to leave the ghetto. Eager to get into orphan. How will you get past the guards? I know a way. Meet me on the other side. Wait, what? The other side! Okay. I guess we can do that. Probably crawl through there? something. If you're a ghost, just leave me be. Spooky ghost of grayscaleness. The shadows. Yeah. All right. There he is. Easy. Wow. Goddess, save us. You're playing with your life, boy. I don't need a goddess to save me. I'm very good at climbing. How did you escape the keep? Apparently so. What? I, I didn't. How do you know about that? Oh, everyone knows the apostle escaped the keep on the night of his execution. There's even a puppet show about it. Really? I want to see that. Shadow, take me. And why do you think I'm that Azadi? Mysterious Apostle Guy escapes the keep. Mysterious Azadi joins the resistance a few days later. I may only be ten years old, and I may have purple skin, but I'm nobody's fool. Yeah. Clearly. What else do you know about me? Smarter kid than Not we much. expected. This is it. Oh, sorry. This is where they have their meetings and speeches and stuff. Are you sure? Positive. Sometimes I listen in. They talk about magicals, and about how we've ruined the world, and taken everything from them. It makes me sad listening to that. I didn't know magicals were so bad. No wonder humans hate us. Uh, we you, don't. you aren't. Look, boy. Bip. Those people are not good people. You have done nothing wrong. You can't help the way you look, or the color of your skin. How and where you've been born doesn't make you a bad person, or less of a person. It just makes you you. It's what you do with your life that matters. And they're doing ah, terrible things with their scram. lives. Get out of here. Go back, and be careful. But... You promised. No arguments. Fine, fine. What? A tip would be appreciated. In recognition <laughs> of all my hard work... Do we even have any money? <laughs> <laughs> You're really something. Here. Now run back, you little thief. I guess we did have some money. Find a way into the uh, National Front meeting. Alright. Good kid. Good kid. Pardon me, do you have any great poupon? I'll need to find a way to get past that goon. I mean, a sword to the stomach works pretty well. Greetings, brother. What? Who's there? God damn it. You gave me a right scare, mate. Where in the Seven Hills did you come from? The only way that I could have come. The shadows. Step aside, I'm late for the assembly. Right, of course. Blood and land, brother. The important thing is not what I say, but how I say it. I must appear forceful and show that I belong at this assembly. I'm not going to just keep guessing. Sooner or later, even this brainless fool will see through my veil and call on the guards. We'll keep this simple. The obvious answer to blood and land is... Blood and land again? Blood and land. Yeah, all right. Wait, that's my line. What's the passphrase? Blood and... You don't belong here. This is a private gathering. Dang it. You people ought to be ashamed of yourselves. How dare you put this muck on my door? Just because I'm human don't mean I'm interested in your specious propaganda. 
I've lived next door to Dol Murray most of my life, and they've never once done me or mine any harm. Here's what I think of your so-called humanist rally. And your honor Hillarist can go fuck himself. He's a traitor. You all are. When the Azadi finally pack up and leave, we will remember what you've done. I like Be this sure woman. Of that. I like this woman. Definitely not a supporter of the National Front, that one. Good woman. Uh, paper segment, invitation. Is there another piece around here? No. All right, well, uh... Aha, there is a more... Uh, something, something for faith and family, humble human servant, honor Hilaris, Esquire, political candidate to the City Watch, invites you to a private gathering tonight in Geopicant Court, I think, at dusk, precisely. Honor and... what? There's a word missing. Hmm. So there should be another piece around here somewhere. Maybe? Not seeing it. It's disgusting what's going on in there. Them bad mouthy magicals like they're the problem. The magicals have always lived here. It's the Azadi who've upset the balance of things. You ought to be more careful speaking ill of the Azadi. The walls have ears. Oh, what are they gonna do? Ship me off to one of their re education camps. I'd like to see them try. I they might think they probably you in would Friars do that. Keep. They wouldn't dare. They respect women, that lot. At least they've got that going for them, unlike those National Front traitors in there. Mark my word. The moment the Azadi leave, the Resistance will hunt down every last one of them and string them up on the city walls. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Balance! Where did you come from, eh? I didn't even see you. What do you want? I don't want no trouble. That piece of paper you tore. Do you have the other half? What piece? The National Front Flyer? Why? Who are you? Someone who's on your side. Well, I don't know. You sound a Zardi to me. What do you want that flyer for? I want to sneak story. in. I need it to find a traitor. A traitor to the rebel cause. Oh, right. Well, if it means getting back at that National Front filth, then by all means. Eh, yes, take indeed. It. And Balance bless you for standing up to those bastards. Excellent. All right. Find the uh, pieces. Honor and humanity. It's the slogan used by the National Front. That must be the passphrase I need to get into the meeting. Vote faith and family. Vote honor, Hillaris. Alrighty. Let's try it now. Hopefully, this magic uh, keeps them from recognizing that we were the one that stopped by earlier. Excuse me, sir. Step aside, brother. God! You snuck up on me. Yeah, you're not very Blood observant. Land. Uh, Don't force. Yes, abandon humanity. Land, honor, and humanity. That's what these people claim to care about. They cling to their slogans like drowning men cling to driftwood. Honor and humanity. Faith and family, brother. Go on through, mate. The meeting's already begun. If you Yay. haven't seen Mr. Illyris speak before, you're in for a proper treat. That man is an example to us all. I'll try to uh, restrain my gag reflex. Yeah, wh 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 what was that supposed to mean? Oh, uh, nothing, nothing, nothing. Brothers, 
sisters. I think we saw that sign Cousins. before. Cousins. Brave, humble human folk. Welcome to this meeting of the National Front for Faith and Family. Yes. Get ready yes. to hate this guy. Yes. 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 Thank you for coming here tonight. Thank you. Thank you for the generosity of your time. Thank you for braving these ill-lit occult courts in your tireless search for truth. Yes. Oh, yes. Despite the selfless work of our benefactors, the enemy lurks out there. No, I don't. I mean, shadows. um... <clears throat> I'm too far away to get a real sense of that person. His left arm keeps twitching. He appears to have some sort of muscular dysfunction. He must be wearing leather undergarments. They make an unpleasant creaking noise. He must be wearing leather undergarments. They make a... There's nothing unusual about that person. I'm too far away to get a real goddess. sense of that person. There's yes. nothing unusual yes. about that person. I spoke recently with our She's benefactors. humming to herself. I spoke to them it's a tune about I that recognize. Immigrant. A sweet lullaby. Magical. I'm too far yes. away to get a real goddess. Yes. That yes. man has a I spoke to them. Odor. I said, listen he could have changed to his clothes or taken a bath in the months. <laughs> Humans oh. brought to their knees Nothing in particular stands out. Magical. So we're just looking at these people. I'm too far corruption. away to get a real sense of... Simple, he smells of lavender oil. Men and women Maybe he's a physician. By the devilish, Nothing in particular stands out. Magical. The necromancer. Her posture is odd. I said to them, I it's said, almost like she's tilting slightly to, to one side. Stand. Now. Now. Her clothes smell strongly of tar and smoke. She must be a factory worker. Behind our own. Just and checking all of the said, people. What you need, what they need. There's what nothing unusual need about that person. Is someone to stand up. I'm and too far away to get a, There's cause. nothing unusual about that person. The true Mercury. Nothing in particular stands out. Someone not afraid of the Mercury. There's nothing unusual about that person. Tongues. He yes. reeks of tobacco. Yes. An Azadia variant, unless my nose you deceives me. me. You know, I see her I mean, used to smoke this. And that's, uh, check. We've checked everyone now. Identify the Yazadi collaborator in the Old Town Market. Okay. Achievement unlocked. Honor and humanity. No way to get up there. Alright, so we've, uh, looked at a few people. Now we need to go see if we can identify the... Acceptance, Actual uh, traitor. Approval, she smiles upon all good humans. Our, our common enemy is the filthy immigrant, the necromancer. Honor Hillary. He leads this, this national about. front for faith and family. Fighting the magical infestation. Can can it's we uh, just have him like accidentally drown or something? Worship. No, 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 no. The Azadi are nothing if not open-minded. They'll never Honor curtail Hillary's. your right to worship He leads your this above. national front for faith course, and family. The goddess represents the truth and the light. She symbolizes the fight against the magical that Ah, one of the worst characters. One of the absolute worst characters. <laughs> All right, let's get down to the uh, market. All right, uh, I am indeed going the right way. Just want to make sure. I suppose I could check, keep checking the maps, but it's fine. All right, now let's see if we can identify the. Uh, Actually, I get a lead mark here for the first time in months. Goddess, I can't wait. I'm so sick of this shit stain in the sea. See if we can identify our uh, traitor. Where have you been? I've been at a, uh, meeting. Actually, hold on. Let's look at him first. Always angry, but a good man to have by your side in a dangerous situation. I suppose so. Where have you been? 
at a National Front meeting, identifying your turncoat. Uh, it takes a traitor to find a traitor. Think you can point him out for us? Yes, it does. Wait a second. Go on, then, before we lose him. All right. Go on, Kian. Show us the traitor, if you can. All right. So let's see. That man. Was he at the National Front Assembly? He smells of tobacco. I'm not familiar with the scent. All right, not it's him. Probably a Northlands weed. Day. I deal in something to you every All right, nope. Reliability. Oh shoot! Dang it! That was that was wrong. Um. Yeah. Let me. Uh. Let me actually. Put on offline mode and save and quit to title. I'm hoping that did not save. <laughs> uh, each uh, new uh, book. Uh, achievement unlocked. The test. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's see. Did that? <laughs> did that say? I, I, I was, I was hoping that I was just like, oh, this is gonna have a, a, a smell or something. Nope, nope. <laughs> okay, good. Sorry, if I leave this on, it, it shows my email address on the uh, main page. I am a little annoyed that that doesn't just like <laughs> close it out. Where have you been? At a National Front meeting, identifying your turncoat. Uh, it takes a traitor to find a traitor. Think you can point him out for us? I can. Go on, then, before we lose him. This time I'll do it correctly. <laughs> Not accidentally click on the wrong thing. Uh. Yeah, so so on the main menu it shows your email address when you're you're connected, and it's a little annoying. Uh, a lot of other games will, will block out parts of it or something like that. And I just don't want that on a permanent video. <laughs> His breathing is heavy and wet. Okay, that doesn't sound familiar. He smells of tobacco. Nope. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a... The Magicals keep their heads high despite the Azadi threat. It's hard to shake the feeling that it's wrong for Magicals to be walking around freely. And I'll have to get used to it. That man. Was he at the National Front Assembly? He smells faintly of camphor, or the pine forests of the north. Maybe lavender oil. All right, so it could be that guy. He looks somewhat familiar. I'm putting him down as a suspect. He smells of tobacco. No. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a Northlands weed. His breathing is heavy and wet. Not sure how many people are actually here. Like who? Who? How many people are actually? His skin appears red and blistered. No. Perhaps he spent too much time in the sun. He smells faintly of camphor, or the pine forests of the north. Okay, so we're looking at the guy with the uh, the broad hat. Are, are the, I'm not sure if there how many people are actually potential suspects here. Beard. Where have I encountered that beard? His breathing is Okay, it seems like there's just the four. His skin appears red and blistered. Perhaps he spent too much time in the sun. He smells faintly of camphor, or the pine forests of the north. Maybe lavender oil. Okay, I think that this is the guy. Let's go ahead and accuse him. Who are you people? Where are you taking me? Have you got the wrong man? Uh, 
Meet up with Enu and Liko at the uh, Rooster and Kitten. All right. Well, I mean, did say uh, lavender oil, so which way am I facing? Uh, other way now that I have not gone. All right. I mean, there weren't any other people around that, uh, I seem to be able to interact with, so. Hopefully we got the right one. Actually, it would be funny if that was the guy that, I don't think it was, but it would be funny if that was the guy that I accidentally accused. Ah, I can't go up the stairs. I want to go up the stairs. What is creating the, uh, the glow? Is it these flowers? Or, no, it's probably that light up there, then. Hello? How you doing? I'm just out for a walk. doo de doo de doo While my veil is active, they cannot recognize me. Not unless I want them to, or I act carelessly. So let's not act carelessly. If you hear the one about the magical and the... If you're a ghost, just leave me be. Ghost. All right. Uh, let's see. I can't see the, uh, the sign there. Where are we looking? Where are we looking? Oh, yeah, it's up here. Okay. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. The construction of the tube network appears to be picking up pace. There are wagon loads of metal pipes everywhere. There really the are, aren't there? Into the night. Iradi Avenue. Jeez, look at all the pipes here. Red threads, hmm. Uh, let's see, three, uh, no, oops, uh, that is, is that the salty semen? Yeah, it is. I think this is where we want, yeah, the rooster and kitten. The rooster and kitten. Ulfik, the barkeep, is friendly with the resistance. There aren't a lot of people out at night, even though the streets appear to be safe. The rooster and kitten. All right, before we go in, let's uh, look around a little bit more. Uh, we can't really get anywhere else, so... Not really much else to actually do, it looks like. People still keep their heads down around Azadi military. They must fear the worst. Oh, they're playing that game, too. All right, this just leads up... Yeah, this just leads up into the uh, the park area. All right, let's go see... Uh, Enu and Liko. Hello! In we go. Smazati soldiers, Markurian patrons. Alvik doesn't have the most sophisticated or upscale clientele, and I'm sure he's happy about that. <laughs> At least they're not a raucous or unruly lot. 
Alvik keeps them in check. It's a pretty high ceiling building, actually. There are mostly laborers and dock workers in this bar. It's the perfect cover for the resistance. I mean, there's also some Azadi soldiers. Alvik doesn't have the most sophisticated or upscale clientele. And I'm sure he's happy about that. Can't actually look at the exit. What's at that? least they're not a raucous or unruly lot. Alvik keeps them in check. Look, I don't see there's a man with a bloody spear behind the curtain wearing Azadi boots and a helmet. I have no idea what you just said, sir. That was a heavy accent. Hello! How can I get you, my good man? I'm not here to drink, and I have no use for alcohol. It clouds the mind, confuses the heart, and taints the soul. Also, look at his apron. Isn't it adorable? Goddess knows I'm not a drinking man. What does one order to blend properly in with the patrons of this filthy hive? I have little faith in the quality of the water in this place, but I can at least hold a cup and pretend to be drinking stronger stuff. Let's just get some water. I'll take a cup of water. Water? Why would you want to order that foul stuff? I'm afraid we serve no water here, da. Dang Fish it. fucking that, you know. <laughs> Here's your merry minstrum, da. Your friend. She's upstairs. Friend? Yes. Your friend. She's been waiting. You don't want to keep a woman waiting for too long. I mean, yeah. Another beer, da? No. Your friend I'm... is still waiting. Up. Stairs. Okie dokie. Ulvik, the publican. He's pleasant enough and apparently a friend to the resistance. If it wasn't for his insistence on making me drink beer, I think I'd quite enjoy Alvik's company. I mean, you don't have to actually drink it. You can still just hold it. Alvik, the publican. He's pleasant enough and apparently a friend to the resistance. Yeah, stairs down to the basement. Alright, I guess we go upstairs. Uh, but I think that's going to have to wait until uh, next time. You, sh you should probably get your, your fingers into the little little finger hole thing there so, so that if it, if it you know it doesn't slip or anything Just, come on Kian do you not know how to hold a mug apparently Kian does not know how to hold a mug and I do not see our friends upstairs I guess we'll have to go upstairs and actually see them but that will be next time see you then everyone